yeah hi we are from SVS embedded the project title name is called one touch alarm system for women safety using GSM GPS and arm 7 so in this project I am using an arm 7 LPC 2148 32 bit processor I am using so here we are using one GSM sim 800L it's a cord band modem I am using and one GPS Rasta 634R 65 channel GPS module I am using and one 16 cross 2 LCD display and one driver IC and one alarm for the indication so this is a switch button this is one touch it is switch button it is connected with the P021 and alarm it is connected with the P1 cap 30 and max 232 UART1 it is connected with the P0.9 and P0.8 UART0 it is connected with the P0.0 and 0 0.1 so this is my entire uh, block diagram let us coming into the hardware part so here I am using an uh, 230 input step down transformer 9 volts output uh, AC it is given to the bridge rectifier filter capacitor 7805 regulator and one LED so this entire section is called power supply section so here I am using an ARM 7 LPC 2148 uh, development board so this is 64 pin IC Q deep quadrupole dual in package line so in uh, total two ports port 0 and port 1 port 0 consists of 0 0.0 to 0 0.31 and port 1 consists of P1.16 to P1.31 it can execute 16 bit byte and 32 bit architecture uh, in this board this is in a 12 mega crystal and this is a ISP button and reset button so if the program is stuck so you need to restart this so this is our switch button one touch switch button so ARM process is working under 3.3 volts so this is a buzzer it operated with BC547 transistor NPN transistor for I current purpose we are operating this this is called the alarm so this is 16 cross 2 LCD display character LCD display whatever the process is going on that should be displayed on the LCD UART0 it is connected with the GPS module Rasta 634R65 channel GPS module and this is UART1 it is connected with the GSM modem this is RS232 cable so here we are using an bridge rectifier filter capacitor LM317 uh, regulator for the 4.5 volts and here I am using one uh, max 232 and this is the G GSM SIM 800L I am using so you can use the micro SIM card ok so you have to insert like this press it and after that you have to keep like this ok so here first of all I am going to connect the power supply ok so this is a network LED so network LED not came yeah yeah network LED is coming ok so here I am giving the power supply so this is the indication of the GPS when it is come the GPS will be come ok women safety project arm 7 this is uh, the given student given the project title arm 7 processor so he, this is parents and police station and friends this is for the parents and friends this is for the police station so latitude longitude yeah we received one sms gsm test to ok 
GPS location is latitude value and the longitude value. Now women is safe. Okay. So now uh, women is so the GPS is coming properly. On and off, on and off LED. Okay. Now I'm going to press the switch. Sending SMS to the parents. Yeah, I am in trouble. Location at latitude value, longitude value. Please help me. This is the first SMS. Okay, na? This is uh, police station. I am in trouble. Location at latitude value, longitude value. Please help me. And this is the third SMS. Okay, for the friends. I am in trouble, location at, latitude value, longitude value and please help me. Okay, this is my location, latitude value, longitude value. So like that, we are, we can add more number of contact numbers onto this processor. This GSM SIM card will send to the multiple SMS. Okay, now, second time. So we can write the program for the continuous sending also. For the testing purpose, we are going to test for the three SMS. One is for the parent, police station, nearby police station and third one is the uh, friends, close friends. Yeah, I received one SMS okay total four sms two time i press on <coughs> yeah thanking you please subscribe for more projects on sws embedded this project the uh, we can develop this project on 8051 avr paid arm 7 msp 430 Arduino. A raspberry pi or banana pi we can develop any controller we can develop this project i develop i can develop all the microcontrollers